Welcome back everybody. Well, last time Ratchet made it to this city place. I forget what the hell it's called. And we discovered that his little good buddy uh, Clank was captured. Let's so we'll fall in. See what else we got here. I uh, level up the multi-star. Sorry about that. I I'm going to do all the leveling up on screen from now on. Uh, so we got a sniper rifle and mini turrets. Pulse rifle, whatever. But uh, I can't afford those right now. Yeah, I'm going to try to do as much leveling up on screen as possible. So here we need the... So you don't have to select it in this game like you did in the first game. Just automatically gets equipped. Ah, I screwed it up there. Sorry. You don't have to equip it like you did in the first game. Just go up to it and press the uh, action button, and it just automatically sets it for you. Get out of my way. Yeah, I know it's, it's a waste of ammo to do this, but I'm trying to level up my weapons. Now stuff like the... I'm not going to be showing up, like I'm going to try to level up every weapon as far as I can. But I'm not going to be showing like the Omegas. They don't really change anything, they look the exact same. Uh, the ultimate weapons or whatever the hell they're, I think they're called Mega weapons in this, I forget. Oh, I screwed. Damn it. Yeah, I'm not going to show them all on screen, I'm going to get them as I play the game more and more and I'll just do extra videos because you probably have to replay the game like two or three times to get it <sighs> keep screwing that up there we go yeah, it takes a while plus they're, they're really damn 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 expensive like, I'm talking like the millions. Millions of bolts. They cost quite a bit. Uh, so here we got a little crane puzzle going on. Alright. Let's just drop it with the X button. Bring the uh, crate over to where you want it. Drop her down. There we go. Wait, did I? Okay, what the hell? Oh, I picked it up, didn't it? Bastard of a crane. You know, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna try to show off all the leveled up forms of the weapons, but not the... Uh... I'll do the uh, ultra and the leveled up ultra forms. Like I said, they're not, they don't do anything different, they're just stronger. They don't do anything different from their uh, normal leveled up form. Other than being slightly stronger, and they, they change the way they look, but... Uh, Blitz gun. But I'm going to do like the, the grinding for experience to level up my weapons off screen and then when I get close to being uh, leveled up, I'll just wait till the video to level them up so you can see what they look like. Because they do slightly change, not a lot or anything fantastic, but they do change. Got everything in here. Yeah, usually with these decryptor-like things, they put a lot of them in a row for the first bit, and they, they kind of disappear as the game goes on. Damn it. They kind of disappear as the game goes on, so you don't see them in as often. There we go. 
activate that. Um, it's kind of awkward controlling this thing a little. So you want to pick up this weird looking one? It'll blow up, that's the door we have to go into. You can also do sh stupid shit like this. Woo! Now it's a laser beam! I'm dragging my lasers! And you can attack enemies like that. what I want to do first. So we're going to get ourselves a titanium bolt here. It's a bit hard to see due to the angle, but I believe right about there. you got to kind of drop this on top of it. Yeah, see, once you see the door blow up, you know you got it. See pieces of the door fly out. There we go, got ourselves a titanium bolt. Yeah, so the blitz gun is the shotgun type. You're going to see it quite a bit through the rest of the series. It shows up quite often. Uh, I can't do anything with that one. They have two types of descriptors here. The infiltrator, I think, is... I don't know. I forget what it's called. That initializer, whatever the one I used right there, and then there's another one. I don't think they have one of those, and I'm trying to remember, I don't think they do have like a decryptor in the first, for um, newest game. Yeah, I don't think they have that. The newest game uh, leaves quite a bit, differs quite a bit from the rest of the series. Even compared to the, uh, it's predator that's predecessors, not just like the these games, but the predecessor to it in the series. It does differ. Ooh. Eh, nothing in there. Nothing in there. I'm also going to be doing some bolt grinding off screen as well. No? Not in there? Oh, right there. Shoot those lights to get some bolts. Clank? So here's our buddy Clank. Clank. Don't move. He doesn't look I'm in good shape. Son of a quark. <laughs> All right, buddy. Let's get you up and running again. There we go. It's all good. Final digit of pi is Clank. Three. Clank, can you hear me? Ratchet. Where are we? Hmm. I must have dozed off. Don't sweat it. Let's just find a way out of here. I believe that air duct may offer our only way out. Okay. So here starts our uh Though still annoying, he's a little easier to tolerate than the. To glide, jump, then hold X while in midair. Uh, I didn't do that. You're supposed to double jump, and then hold on the second. Um, it's not as annoying as the first game because they're they're not as long. They're a little shorter. So we can't get past that guy. Otherwise, he'll just shoot you with his laser. So what you have to do... So 
So what you do is you kind of tell your bots to wait right there. And then you get them to salute. And then you get them to attack. So you kind of got to change, you got to make it focus on you on in the opposite direction. Like focus right there and then get him to attack, otherwise he'll just destroy them. Use it to build bridges across gaps. Uh, there, all our buddies are together. So here's a newer thing, is you have different specific bots, like the bridge bot, then there's will allow you to get across gaps, and then they have other bots, a uh, hammer bot, which will hammer stuff. Yeah, you gotta aim the laser away from them. Here's the other guy here. Lifter bot acquired. Use it to lift large blocks. And we get the lifter bot. And we'll get him to lift something. Like this convenient door place to show us how he works. There we go. It's not too bad. They're a little more interesting than the the first game. Bot. And we need two of those guys to enter here. So the number on the top is how many you need. And you just get them to enter and the door opens. Not bad, eh? <laughs> Nothing doing. No kid. Great. Now let's go get that experiment back. So that was a little uh, went a little quicker than the original. Um, what am I? Oh, so like before, duck and jump to do the higher jump. jump. Hold R1 and press X. And then you also have the jump long jump. Distances. Hold the R1 and press. Um, jump. Gaps, press X to jump, then press and hold X while in midair. Yeah, so basically that just jump and then double jump again, but hold the button. Plank also comes with a thruster pack option. The thruster pack has the same moves as the helipack, except it uses rocket propulsion. To select the thruster pack, go to the gadgets menu and select the icon. Yeah, it's pretty much just the same. It's the same thing. So here we are back at the begin. Alright. Oh, actually, I got, uh, got some more money. So almost. Hopefully I'll be able to get that pulse rifle in the next video. It's pretty cool. It's if you're a sniper fan, you're gonna love that. But the thing, it, it's very powerful, but it comes with uh, very little ammunition. So knock over that trash can, and those cleaner bots will show up. That's what they are. They're cleaner bots. So if you just start making a mess, oh crap! They'll send security bots after you after a while, I guess. I don't know. Well, I don't know what to talk about at this point. I guess I just keep talking about the game, but who knows. As you notice, if you're, if you're too far, you won't do... Uh, you won't cause any damage to the enemy with this gun. Shut the hell up. Ah. And we'll jump off the end here. Ah. Well, I, I guess I kind of spoiled that because you can see the ladder. 
There we go. Another titanium bolt. Like I said, in, in this game, the titanium bolts have a little bit of a different use. They upgrade your weapons to have special abilities. There's like, there's, I think there's only one bolt that I've never been able to get. Alright, so in the next episode, I'll knock over this trash can and see how things go. Thank you for watching, and have a good day. Bye.